What's up guys, welcome back to another video. Welcome to beautiful Jamaica. Jamaica, baby. This is Skylar's first time in the country. And this week we are at the Excellence Oyster Bay in the Excellence Collection. This is one of their newest resorts. And this place is really dope. And it's really, really big. It goes for miles down that way. Got some breakfast at the buffet called the Kitchen Table. This is their main buffet that they have. Kept it simple and classy. Scrambled eggs, strawberries, hash browns, French toast, and a donut. And as Skylar, she's weird. She gets lunch stuff for breakfast. Look at that. Look at that chicken and rice mixed with some strawberries and a biscuit and hash brown. She's just weird like that, but you cannot be to that view overlooking the ocean. So beautiful. <laughs> Make room for me, babe. I think this swing in the ocean is the coolest thing of the whole place. Honestly, it's such a simple feature, but it's so picturesque and beautiful. Let me try to get on there without dropping this camera in the water. That'd be kind of bad. Let's see, can I stand on here? Or am I gonna stand? Am I gonna slip off? Okay. Oh, jeez. No, no. Ready? Smile for the pick. Ready? Smile. I'm just getting taking the video. Let's cue the rest of the video. Hope you enjoy. Let's go. Walking up to a room, first of all, outside it is really, really sweet. So you got a bunch of trees behind me right here. Looks like a jungle. And then over there, you can see the mountains in the distance. Let me give you guys a better shot. Check out those mountains. This is the balcony right outside our room. As you can see, there's a big hallway down there with a bunch of other rooms. So let's go into ours. Welcome to the crib for the week. This place is probably the dopest, the fanciest, and the most amazing resort room I've ever stayed in. So starting here on the left, you got the bathroom. Walk in here, and by the way, we've been in here for a day, so it's not fully organized. But here's the walk-in shower. Very nice, very nice. Got a couple of towels over there, and then the double vanity sink. A lot of space in here. And I wish we had this in our apartment. Two, two sinks, two different mirrors, because it helps drive me and Skylar, less crazy getting ready in the morning. Moving into the bedroom. By the way, there's a full mirror on the wall here. Say what up, what up? Here's the bed. It is super big, super comfy. We had a very good night's sleep last night. Cannot complain about this whatsoever. Moving into the living room area, you have a standard couch, chair right there. Another, what's that called? Love seat right there. And then a table here, of course, provided with some white wine upon our arrival. If you want this, feel free to come here and take it because I hate wine, but it is a nice touch. Of course it is. But this is the ultimate part of the room, right babe? The there is a hot tub, a jacuzzi, overlooking the balcony outside and the beach area out there. Let me focus that camera for you. So you can see all the areas out there. Yeah, the jacuzzi is right here overlooking all that. It is super dope and relaxing. We sat in here last night and my God, I was probably the most relaxed I've ever been. Yeah. Ever. We don't need the past in our lives for tomorrow. Never see the end of the night for sorrow. What do we do to love? What do we do to love? What do we do to love? When everything's said and done. What do we do to love? What do we do to love? What do we do to love? When everything's said and done. What do we do to love? Hi guys, we have a Bob Marley shot. Bob Marley shot, and it was pretty cool. Ready? Cheers. <laughs> Tastes like crap, looks sweet. Seven out of ten. It's good, it's good. Oh! Good time. <coughs> One more time. One more. Today we booked an excursion. Every time we stay at one of these all-inclusive resorts, we love to do something fun and adventurous. I know a lot of people just want to sit back with a pina colada on the beach and chill for a couple days. That's perfectly fine, but we love to get out and do something. So we got picked up from the resort and we headed over to the Martha Bray River. And the two excursions we're doing today is the first one is the water tubing and the second one is the bamboo rafting. So we hopped on this shack of a bus. It's a really bumpy ride through the woods and the jungle. Uh, dropped us off at our destination on the river and we had the sweetest tour guide of all time named the president. Oh, 
Is that prison? Come back you want Tony. I'm in the night, you know? Uh -huh. Oh, in the take it a good lunch. Tony had a Tony had a Hey! I tell you! Oh my god, I survived! Yeah, but yeah. Yeah. I'm <laughs> all right, all right. I'm not sure if it's morning or afternoon, so I'm gonna say good after morning. Okay. Good after morning, everyone. Good after morning. Good after morning. Let me try one more time. Good after morning, everyone. Good after morning. You ready to do nothing? Yes. Yep. This feeling is a relaxing tour where you lay back in your tube and do nothing. And that's exactly what we did. For about an hour, we sit back and did nothing, relaxed on the Martha Bray River there. We got a mix of a history lesson from the dude, as well as some trivia questions and a couple of riddles to solve as well. We also saw some animals that we wouldn't see otherwise. We saw a big herd, flock, I don't know what the proper word is, of cows running through the jungle right past the river. That was pretty cool. As well as some, uh, some snakes and some spiders, which honestly freaked me out. Here is the bamboo rafting as well. This was honestly probably like the one of the one of the most fun things I've ever done, and one of the most unique things we've ever done. Uh, that dude there, his name was uh, Randall. He gave us that that really good leg massage mixed with these salts that really had the tingling sensation. But uh, my God, it felt awesome, and overall, it was just super relaxing, super nice guy as well. The hospitality here is incredible. Everyone was uh, extremely extremely nice. Mm, yum. Cheers. Yeah, very good. The rum punch in Jamaica is way stronger than the US. You know, one takeaway I've gotten from being here in Jamaica is that island time is a real thing and it's such a beautiful thing. So island time is where everything takes longer than the time they quote you. So they say, I'm gonna get your beer in five minutes. It might take them 15 to 20 minutes because they're on island time, which is more relaxed, less of like you're trying to meet a deadline or a timeline. And that's honestly nice. I think in the US, it's such a rat race, especially living in, in like downtown Atlanta like we do. A lot of times it gets so stressful uh, for no reason like when you think about it how truly important in the big in the big picture in this huge worldly view is that deadline at work or that project that's due at, at a certain time how important are those things actually when you come to a place like this you realize these people are, are taking their time with everything they're not stressed they're very relaxed they're actually happy i wish the u.s was was more so like that it really is such an amazing vibe and it's not just here but it's, it's throughout all the Caribbean. It's, it's honestly like most places outside the U.S. and the rest of the world, the people seem much more happy than, than Americans do on average. Off the beaten track to become a better man Sinking in the sand, oh We don't need the past that don't last for tomorrow We actually got upgraded to the Excellence Club as part of the trip and what that means is that you get private areas only to yourself at both ends of the resort. So the pools, the hot tubs, some of the cabanas like these, these are only for Excellence Club members. I'm actually here with my work. So there's about 12 or 14 of us here in Jamaica and my work does an annual reward trip for everyone who hits their metrics and goals from the prior year. Fortunately, I work with a very good company with a great group of people, people who I actually consider my friends outside of work. That is another thing I'm, I'm honestly pretty blessed with because I know a lot of people work with people who they respect and they get along with but are they actually good friends most of the time I don't think so but Skylar is here because my work has the amazing benefit where these rewards trips we can bring our spouse or our plus one I'm grateful that she's here as well we're going on three years actually if you notice at the start when I gave the tour there's a banner on our door this is happy three-year anniversary they asked us when we checked in what are we celebrating and we're not celebrating anything we're here in my work but we told them our three-year anniversary that's actually in July but they don't know that so they we got a couple good He's a part of that as well. This place is, is pretty clutch.
Alright guys, fit check, even though my hair is not done yet, fit check, rolling out to dinner. What we got, babe? What you got? 360. I'm blind right now, I don't have my glasses on. What you got though? Have Where's this from? I'm not sure, H&M or something, Air Possible. Get close to the lens. This style, this hairstyle, I don't know what this is called, but the bun on top with the two bangs coming down on either side of her face. This is the most attractive style I think a female could wear. And I don't know what it is, I don't even know what it's called, but I dig it. Mm -hmm. I dig it. And as we roll out, take in this view behind us of the beach and the sunsets and the palm trees. You know what I love? What I love? Palm trees. Palm trees, baby. Palm trees. 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 I love palm trees. So, take this in. Very beautiful. Palm trees. Very beautiful. Overlooking Jamaica. Let's get to dinner. As always, I am super grateful for getting to do something like this, especially with Skylar, my amazing girlfriend, and this was an absolutely beautiful place. I hope you enjoyed another vacation vlog today as much as I did making it. If you're new here, we love to do these all the time, so make sure you follow along. Jamaica, guys, Jamaica. You like it? Good uh, time? I, this is my favorite country by far. So yeah. Far. So we, we've gone a lot of places since uh, we started dating, mm -hmm. and we've actually been in a number of different countries, but. I would agree that country-wise, Jamaica's where it's at. With all that being said, I really appreciate if you made it to the end. If you did, please drop me a thumbs up. I really appreciate it. Also, subscribe to my channel if you have not yet because I drop a new video every single Monday that you don't want to miss. As always, guys, work hard, be nice to people. I'll see you guys next Monday.